In this video today, I will show you how to jailbreak iOS 17.7.10 on iPad. After watching this video, you will be able to jailbreak it easily. And uh, if you want to jailbreak, then you need to download Skynet Tool Ultra Latest version for use. As you can see, I already download jailbreak tool. Now I need to open for jailbreak. After opening the jailbreak tool, you need to connect the device you want to jailbreak. Before try to jailbreak, need active serial number for jailbreak. Because without active serial, you can't jailbreak. Now I will open the website for active serial. I use two websites. One is bestofunlock.com and the other is skynettool.com. You can use any one of them. First, I will open bestofunlock.com, login, click on the dashboard, select order now and select IMEI service. Then type ultra in the search bar will find jailbreak service. But I have already account in skynettool.com. So I place order from skynettool.com. After opening the website, click on search and type ultra. Then all jailbreak services will be displayed. Now I select the service and copy the serial from the tool and place the order on the website. Then wait for two minutes. After the active serial, you can jailbreak. But my serial is already active. Now I will show you the method to jailbreak. First, I will disconnect the USB from the device and switch off after powering off. You need to press the home button and connect the USB cable after going into recovery mode. Release After going into recovery mode, release the home button. Now click on jailbreak button in jailbreak tool. After opening another page for jailbreak, you will create DFU mode for jailbreak. This is very important for you. If you can't, then it won't bypass iCloud lock. After clicking on the start jailbreak button, press the power and home buttons at the same time. After 5 to 7 seconds, release the power button but do not release the home button. Release the home button after you hear a sound from your PC. If DFU mode is successful, it will automatically jailbreak. If there is any problem, do not do anything. Try again. It will be shown in the following. Now all completed jailbreak has been successful. Now you can bypass iCloud lock if you have it. In this video, I'll show you how to bypass Kinet Tool Fire. It's unlimited bypass after active tool. You can see that the jailbreak has been done. So show the jailbreak here. Later I will show you on 3U tool. You will also believe it. If I get your feedback, I will try to make better videos uh, for you. So please subscribe my YouTube channel. Now I need to open bypass tool, Skynet tool, fire for bypass my iPad 6th generation. If you are seeing fire on Skynet tool for the first time, 
then quickly download and register your name and the active tool will bypass unlimited without any problem. This tool will fix notifications, messages and FaceTime after bypass. You can use it and there is no need to change serial number to bypass this tool just jailbreak and bypass with 5 seconds. Let me show you. I have already been active for a day. Really the best tool I liked because it works fast. Now I will open the website only if registered the username ordered will automatically activate your account. I use two websites. One is bestofunlock.com and the other is skynettool.com. You can use any one of them. I just show you two link and how to use it. I am active for one day with a username for unlimited work. On bestofunlock.com you can activate or skynettool.com for global user and for Binance user in the world. Now go back to open the bypass tool for bypass. After clicking bypass, if I don't understand you the bypass well, it won't be easy to work. So don't waste your valuable time. I just selected the bypass service and clicked on the bypass button. It will be bypassed within 4 seconds. This way you can use Skynet tool fire. I hope you understand. Thank you for your valuable time inshallah. I will come back with another such video.